criteria for selecting, identify performance indicators, factors to consider, develop robust mechanisms for learning to improve the quality and impact of MAE in the mission. We hope and pray to professionalize and institutionalize monitoring, evaluation, and learning. Your name and address. It become an alumni of KIPTC. And uh, there are so many advantages you gain. A list will drop. You have past, you have present, and you have future. There are levels of what? Control. Levels of what? Provision of support. In order for you to operationalize that mandate, you put in place a mission implementation plan. The focus is today. And what does exit mean in their... Departure. Leave yeah, it. It, 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 <laughs> it feeds their yeah. interest. To see how far we've gone with implementing the plan, and on the basis of the feedback, then you look support to this, you know, operational goal that we have. Now, then there's also the whole idea of making sure that you have the conduct, yes. the concept of operation, yes. which might be for a period of time. We want to see an AMISOM that has a learning system, a system that gives feedback in terms of the strategies we are adopting to ensure that if there is some you know, challenge with the strategies and approaches we are using in attaining mission mandate, we can, you know, as a mission, be able to revise them and to use strategies that are more effective and strategies that are, you know, give us efficiency in the use of the resources that we've been given, you know, by, by our member states and our partners. And so, in the end, we expect to see a more effective mission, um, you know, uh, mandate implementation from our colleagues in AMISOM. This is the thought process that through which you finally be deployed here. If there's a mistake anywhere there, it affects you. You will be able to integrate all the facets of the mission to do systematic system-wide evaluation and provide greater clarity on your operations. I'll be waiting eagerly to see the outcomes of this training, not only to evaluate the very training itself, but also to be able to earmark the deliverables. Thank you, General. Thank you, the facilitators. And thank you so much, our dear colleagues, the participants. The most important thing that we want to do is to build the capacities of the um, staff of the mission and then in the long run want to see monitoring evaluation professionalized and institutionalized in the mission. And so our vision is to see MNE become part and parcel of the mission.